The Democrats have their two articles of impeachment, abuse of power and obstruction. The articles might as well be, we hate you and we can't beat you. They've been trying to impeach Trump since before he was the Republican nominee. In March 2016, the New York Daily News wrote this, impeach Trump, it's not too early to start. Then right after Trump was elected president, the media starts salivating. My prediction is, based on my gut, that there's a very good chance that Donald Trump could face impeachment. Then, the day of Trump's inauguration, the Washington Post announces the campaign to impeach the president has begun. The whistleblower's attorney was tweeting about impeachment years ago, and the FBI agents were texting about impeachment and the insurance policy way, way back. The FBI used intelligence briefings to spy on him. They wiretapped his staff. They leaked, and they hatched stings. Trump caught wind of it and fired Comey. So Comey leaked and triggered a special counsel. A two-year witch hunt when Mueller already knew there was no collusion. What was he doing that whole time? He was just building an obstruction case against the president, and that dark cloud cost Republicans the House. Bill Barr finally got there and called their bluff. No collusion, no obstruction. And then the same week the Mueller hearing bombed, Adam Schiff hatched the whistleblower plot. So Trump called their bluff again and releases the transcript. No bribe on the call, no pressure. 